After being diagnosed with kidney cancer, Anne Ogden Gaffney didn't want to feel scared. I'd been diagnosed, but I was okay, and so made a pact with myself that until I was told that I wasn't going to be okay, that everything was fine. Ogden Gaffney channeled her positive energy into the kitchen. She says she found comfort in cooking. My granddad was a chef, my uncle was a chef, my other uncle owned the, the Italian store in town, mm -hmm. and my dad was a master baker, so it's always always been around food. Four years after her kidney cancer fight, the Manhattan resident received another diagnosis, this time breast cancer. She took a closer look at the impact of diet on her treatment. Her experience led her to launch Cook for Your Life. She teaches cancer patients and caregivers how to make simple, nutritious meals. The self-taught chef says the dishes are soothing for those in treatment. It's not just because of, of nausea, or, but the taste changes. They're just the, how what you thought would make you feel good didn't. And, and I realized I had the tools to kind of play around with that. The classes aren't just cooking lessons. They are lifelong tips on maintaining a healthy diet. Some of our patients come in not really having many cooking or kitchen skills, but they are really interested in eating healthy. For one patient, the free classes are life-changing. When you're in the chemo, there's uh, so little you can really eat. Her recipes are very simple, and it's very easy, and, and, and has a lot of nourishment, and it's delicious, of course. Ogden Gaffney says that's what Cook for Your Life is all about. When somebody comes up to me after a class and says a loved one they're looking after actually was able to eat something for the first time in, in, in days, those kinds of things, they, they, you know, they get, make me realize it's worth doing. So for helping cancer patients heal through healthy meals, Anne Ogden Gaffney is our New Yorker of the Week. Pat Kern in New York One.